Hey guys, what did Martin Luther King like to eat? While a short answer can be found by doing a quick internet search, I hope to do a little better than that. Today, I'm going to tour the MLK birth house, try a recipe from Mother King herself, visit a historic Atlanta restaurant where Dr. King ate and planned civil rights strategy, and finally make a dinner containing a few of his favorites that perhaps you might like to try. I hope you enjoy this episode of Soul Season, honoring Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Because I'm still segregated. So Mr. Pastor's younger brother said, we're going to build a hotel. Of and we built a, a six, seven story hotel with a beautiful swimming pool and a banquet room in the hotel that hold about 200 people. A young man came with the pastor and said, Mr. Pastor, he said, I want to see you and your brother. He said, my name is Martin Luther King Jr. I need your help. He said, I we want to form a coalition. He said, John Lewis. Andrew Young and Dr. Ralph Abernathy and, uh, and Jose William and everything. They wanted to meet so that they can start to integrate the buses and the uh, and uh, the restaurants and the schools. Mr. Pastor told them that he and his brother had a hotel suite upstairs that was theirs and that they could meet there and they hold about 35 people. And he said, but I could only meet there on one condition. Dr. King said, what is that? And he said, he told Dr. King said that if they eat this fried chicken, and Dr. King said he loved to eat Mr. Pr Dr. Dr. Fried no Chicken for years. <laughs> he said, hey, that's no problem. 
So they met that day and night. And sometimes they had stairs so all the way to feed them breakfast, lunch, and dinner. And they changed clothes up there. The wives would bring them clothes to change and they would bathe and shave and everything upstairs.
please don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. It's soul season.